Hi everyone, welcome. It's good having you here. During the holidays, it is so easy to become overwhelmed with shopping and company and, in my case, a lot of extra work and all these sort of things. And maybe we're not getting all the rest we should. Now, the first thing you need to do is try to get more rest. We all need that. It's vital for recovery and it helps us keep our youthful appearance a bit longer as well. Lack of sleep is one of the hardest things on our bodies, especially on our faces. And if you've missed a night's sleep uh, and looked in the mirror the next day, you may know exactly what I mean. There are a lot of products out there that make a lot of claims. And some of them are just temporary fixes. Uh, there's one commercial that I see on later in the evening about a product that takes away fine lines and things for an hour or two. Well, what good is that? that I call that the Cinderella effect. You go out for a few hours and you're wrinkle free, then suddenly the product stops working and your wrinkles pop back. <laughs> and uh, that would be kind of embarrassing, wouldn't it? You'd be better off just going out with your wrinkles. After all, you earned them, right? Those are your medals of success and of survival. But if you don't want to show those off, there are some things that you can do. So first of all, you need to look at what causes that. Well, as we age um, or we have lack of sleep or other things, uh, we can lose tone in our skin. Uh, some of the, you, did you know that hyaluronic acid is a natural part of our bodies? Yeah, that's right. It's in your skin right now. And if you put on a few years like me, you have less of it now than you did when you were younger. But there are ways of returning it, or at least helping supplement it a bit through the skin. That's right. There are natural products out there. When I say natural, I mean made from natural products. This particular product can be made from wheat. It can be made from, well, from various different things. Mine is not wheat. I went with a gluten-free formula of hyaluronic acid um, because there are people that have allergies. Not a lot of them, but they're out there. Um, and so this is one of those products where I've tried to make it as pure and good for you as possible using a lot of good, pure products. Um, the golden jojoba oil. Well, jojoba oil is not an oil. Actually, it's a wax, but it's a wax that remains liquid at room temperature. But what's wonderful about it, it matches the natural sebum in our skin. It is easily accepted by our body and can help with retaining moisture and adding plumpness to the skin. Almond oil. It is a very thin and moisturizing oil. It has a lot of benefits in it. Uh, there are specific minerals uh, and vitamins that are in these oils that absolutely are beneficial to your skin. The rosehip oil has been renowned for millennia for its fantastic effects on the skin and most specifically on the face, and is used commonly in products. Sea buckthorn thorn oil, another delicious oil that is terrific for, again, for helping add back some of that precious moisture and plumpness to our skin. I have used this all in conjunction with some vitamin E oil, which is obviously one of the best oils for skin, right? And combining all these together to make a product that you can take just a drop, one drop of, very lightly massage in circles under your eyes or in other areas where you have lines and see what happens. I've done it myself and I've been pretty impressed. Uh, I'm not going to video my ugly old mug for this, and I don't have a model that I can use. So what am I going to do? If you buy this from me, I will give you a money-back guarantee. And I don't know of anyone else that does that, at least homemakers like myself. But I'm going to give you a money-back guarantee. What do you have to lose? Um, these are going to, these do cost a little bit, 
bit more than some of my other little serums and things, but that's because of the oils and the amounts of them that I'm using. I am not being cheap in the ingredients and I'm not being stingy with them. I want this to be a product that actually works and it does. Uh, there's nothing additional added. The ingredients are all things you can read and understand. There's nothing complicated in here. And I want you to be able to know what it is that you're using. And you will with this product. Use it. If you don't see within a few weeks any improvement, fine, let me know and I'll return your money minus the shipping and handling. I can't eat shipping and handling, so, or shipping, there is no handling. And I don't charge exorbitant shipping. I charge whatever Etsy charges and nothing above that. I don't charge any other handling fees. It's just whatever they charge. So that's it. It's, it's the holidays. And I'm just trying to think of ways that I can help. Uh, well, I'm helping myself too. Let's not, I, you know, I'm not trying to be coy here. Obviously, when I sell an item, do I make a profit off of it? I try to. I don't make big profits because, well, I just, I, I just don't do that. Uh, I don't even know that I could in this particular arena. But I'm happy with the way things work as they are. And I'm not trying to get rich doing this. There are other ways to do that. Even the biggest soapers on YouTube, they do not live real high off the hog. I can tell you that I know this for a fact because so much of what we make in this industry goes right back into it. And there's nothing wrong with that. If you love what you do, it's okay. You can live with that. As long as you're happy and you can pay your bills, that's terrific. So I won't go on a whole lot longer about this, but I do want to tell you all how happy I am to know you all. I have been reading what other people have been doing on their channels, uh, hearing the feedback that others have been giving me, and the feedback that I get to share with others on their channels. It is so much fun. I hope you're all enjoying your venture, whether you are a maker or you're, you're a subscriber or you're both. It doesn't matter. You're appreciated. And I'm really glad that you're here and that you've spent some of that time with me because you, there's so many other things out there to see. After all, you could be could looking at a cat falling off of a shelf right now. Instead, you're here with me. <laughs> that means a lot to me. So I wanted to say thank you for that. Have a fantastic day, everyone, and I'll see you back soon. Goodbye.